Hello and welcome back to Space Engineers. My name is Raben Schild. I just cleaned up the world and that that is nice. Cleaning up the world always helps with with FPS problems and with with all that stuff. This trash, trash removal thing is a good good thing uh, to be able to just do that. The debris field for example that we found that is crazy. All these small flying objects that's that's uh, and I found stuff where I was completely surprised. Really fast flying stuff, five thousand kilometers away, and all that stuff. And that that definitely needs removing uh, five blocks or something like that. That just fly there. Good in a live stream on Saturday. I worked out the form of the ring station basically that I want to uh, that I want to do here and n not the the outside form basically and it still needs tweaking for example the the bottom here or the uh, this is I'm not happy with this at the moment this needs a bit of changing but we found a good a good way to uh, to deal with it maybe being too <laughs> too smooth and all that stuff. So you can see, I, I don't know if I shot that off um, except on Saturday, but I don't think that I shot that off in a video. I completed the ring and now I can start building here. And I want to first finish this room, uh, make a dock for the Empress so I can dock her into or to the station in a good way and not with this single strand of with this single strand of uh, connectors here, uh, connectors, conveyors. And it, it needs to look good, I think. So I talked about a bit uh, of my frustration with the um, enhanced exploration mod. Not, not frustration, but it's a good mod. I love that it brings in more ships and all that stuff. But I, for myself, I thought it would be a bit more. So. I flew around for hours to find uh, wreckage and all that stuff and that didn't work out quite easy. Um, I found this debris field, otherwise I didn't find much. I found another trade station, but mm, nothing else much. And, oh, <laughs> I, s <laughs> I stopped the entities and this freighter also stopped. Hmm. Maybe I need to manually remove it, but I will keep it for keep it here for now. And maybe at one point it just starts up again. I don't know. Um, so finding wreckage didn't work out so well. And my plan on not drilling might be jeopardized because I need stuff and I need to find platinum and gold. And I, I can't find it... Uh, in in wreckage so there's not enough wreckage around me to to warrant just to warrant just working with with salvaging uh, might not work out we will have to see maybe there are people out there um, that can say okay what you need to do is um, change the configuration files or something like that then i would gladly do that to maybe get more encounters um, and maybe more attacks. I, I would be willing to, what I thought would be nice would be attacks, for example. So I'm at the moment, there's not a lot of attacking going on here. So I had one or two drones show up and that's not enough. <laughs> so yeah, we, we need to solve that problem a bit. Uh, for you that are interested, um, last week I wasn't able to record and the week before was also a bit slow uh, because I had an, an exam and there will be another one coming coming up uh, soon, next Monday basically, and I had to learn for that and I was a bit stressed out. And so I, yeah, I wasn't able to record, but I can uh, report that I... Uh, yeah, I did good, and the first the first one uh, worked out pretty well, and now I can concentrate on the second one. So 
uh, just for you that, m that might be interested. I don't know. Good. Another thing that happened in the in the stream was that I thought about taking a look at other uh, armor mods because um, yeah we we saw that um, stuff like like this here for example isn't easily done so there's no good amount of armor blocks for yeah for for this here I could just and that's what I did um, that's what you see me saw me remove uh, put a slope in here and I don't know and I wanted to see if there's a mod out there that brings in more armor slopes that I that I could use there and that's what I did so heavy light armor half corner inverted base <laughs> so you can see there's I've I've put in a few more a few more mods that we don't know maybe maybe can take a look at oh, okay these are slabs although these these could already do the trick the slabs for example not here but here for example maybe someone some some mod author has put in has put in things that that could help here this this, for example, looks exactly like a thing that I would need. So five. Oh, see, immediately I'm, I'm happy again. Um, so there must be four. The four thing. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed. That's exactly what I needed. So a way to fill in this part here without having this this step in here done <laughs> what mod is that what mod is that this is heavy armor slab slopes uh it's not this one window blocks by the way i removed some mods and um i cleaned out the mod list a bit more uh, dummy large blocks do 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 letters armor blocks what what is that the slabs shower stool no but there there are also some interesting blocks here more of the roundish variant but I'm not sure if if stuff stuff like that works out so where can I where can I find find that diggy max packs is it is this a mod without uh without its own without its own category hmm Light armor slab slope. There, <laughs> this light armor slab. That seems to be the thing. Light armor corner split invert. Mm, okay, I, I I might have to live with that explanation. So I might be going in and just remove these ones and see. Uh, maybe maybe there are solutions in here too. But yeah, I'm I'm absolutely not sure. I will find out because some people asked for me to put that into my co into my mod collection not mod collection yeah i have a collection with mods that i like on steam and i recently updated that to uh, reflect what i have in this game here and some other mods that i pretty much like and i want to yeah i want to put in this one here too to see yeah to be able to fix stuff like this that was pretty pretty easy good now I can continue with the work here I wanted to do all the work here on the station in streams or in in between episodes and all that stuff so yeah that's 
the first thing I wanted to do was, hey, find out more about the, uh, yeah, find more ships and all that stuff. And yeah, I tried to do that. I can't show you anything here. But again, I would be happy if all the people could decide with me if it's okay for me to just go out mining. Because again, I can't find any wreckage and let's say it that way i don't need a decision there because the decision basically is made i want to go and find at least the precious materials like platinum and gold um, trading for it might work out but a big problem with that is that at one point i would need to uh, go digging for stuff anyway because if I just trade off all my iron or something like that, then, uh, yeah, then, hmm, <laughs> then I have a lot of platinum, but I don't have any iron. Let us take a look at this Atlas Heavy Freighter, because I saw that in the, in the, in the list. Oh, okay, now, now we need to take a look at this. I turned off all the the weapons on the on the empress and that's a thing i now need to revert i brought in in the stream some uh, wreckage from the first smugglers legacy the thing is the thing is and okay, i i brought in wreckage from the first point the, the this point where we found the big wreckage and i um got not attacked but there was an enemy ship and i thought it would attack me but it didn't and that's another thing i i thought enemy ships would try to get you but they they didn't do that so what we could do is attack ourselves but at the moment it is still sorry <laughs> it's still coming closer but it seems to just move through the sector so should should we go and attack i'm willing to try that i'm absolutely willing to try that this is yeah I'm, as far as i know the mod makes it so that if you attack ships they the the factions basically start to attack you more and more so you can get into trouble with the civilian factions here, for example, and then the police will come and try to hunt you down. So if I attack the pirates, will they then in return attack me more? So if that happens, then we at least can get a bit more fighting action and maybe a bit more wreckage with that. So... <laughs> Uh, I might go out mining anyways. And um, I want to go to the planets at one point. Um, people ask me constantly about uh, if the wheels work and how this all uh, checks out now. And I have no way to test that. So we need to find a place on a planet and then um, work there on stuff like the wheels and see if if not we can get them to run but if we can um basically oh, okay now it will get i hope they don't have two crazy weapons here okay there are missile turrets on there no 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 that's too much Ah, oh, that's too much. Lasers, lasers, lasers. Oh, do I still have the... Okay, the back thruster is still there, so we can... Oh, see that? The repair system went in and repaired the, the stuff. Am amazing. Amazing. Okay, we, we have a few... A few damaged, 
a few damaged parts down here. But that's okay. That's okay. I can live with that. Did the plasma cannons get... The ship is offline. I thought what happened there, but the ship seems to be offline. So now... Uh, let us try to... To slow that down. Oh, I don't have the... I don't have the... The... Oh, one thruster is missing. I don't have the the landing gear and uh, on here anymore. I, I've put the landing gear on here. Now slowing this down might pose a problem. So... How can we do that? Let me try to get closer to this one and see if we can... If we can, don't know, slow it down somehow. Do we have the problem that drifting ships are faster than ships that are in pursuit? Because I the, the, the ship gets away from me. And I don't know. <laughs> hmm. So something that is hit drifts away from me, although I'm under power. That is bizarre. Yeah, it's the it's the speed limitations. The problem is that I if I would add a speed mod, I don't know if the ships would just um, uh, try to match that and then be as fast as I am. Oh, by the way, here that's what I lost. I lost thrusters, and I lost the the gun here in the back. So, not good, not good. The thrusters cost us a lot of materials. I can't get closer to this thing. I'm, I'm now dampeners off. I'm trying to coast behind it, but it gets away. What way is there to capture one of these ships? Let me know if you have a solution for that, and not, not something like, uh, not something like, uh, tractor beams or something like that. What what would be the solution a solution for that? But because now I have wreckage, I could uh, take that and I could work with that, but I can't get after it because I'm not fast enough. Would the What could I do? Could I, for example, let me test something. Let me test something. If I just go and say jump drive, turn off the remove the thing and go for a blind jump, just, okay, five kilometers would be the jump, the, the jump that I could go for. Now the question is, can I see my target then? Now, looking back, there it is. So, That must be the wreckage. So what I can do now is fly towards it, then slow down and fly backwards. It's still maneuvering. This thing is still maneuvering. How can it be faster than me? Ah, 
how can it be faster than me? How, how does that work, people? Okay, I, I might have to uh, leave here because this is, again, this is just ridiculous. I can't get, I can't get them because we are as fast as them. Um, would a gravity drive? No, I, a gravity dri drive just brings me up to speed. So uh, this wouldn't work. We are have the same speed. I can just work with with the jump drive, for example. And at the moment, this thing is not attacking me. So, yeah, good people. That that <laughs> I will fly back. This is not worth it. I'm burning fuel uh, without being able to to really to really get that thing. Um, I can try another jump. And attack it again but this will not help okay let's turn around again fly towards it give it the broadside and see if I can maybe I can bring it to fly back to the to the Empress? Come on, shoot down. Shoot it down. And it's so fast! I don't know why it's so fast. <laughs> Okay, I could do this now for hours, but I, I won't. People, um, I think that's all for today. We hope that this leads to the pirates being a bit more active in my area. And hopefully we can get uh, basically wrecks that fly around us. Oh, by the way, uh, one thing that I got told in stream is that the... What's this? That the... The area beacons really only uh, remove ships that are friendly, basically. So I can't remove uh, enemy ships with it. That's that was our problem with the uh, with the ship that I had there, the the big wreckage. So I will test the area beacons again and maybe try it with neutral ships or something like that. We will have to see. Good people. Hope you liked the episode. Um, next time again. We will uh, do a bit more work and hope you can help me with uh, with figuring out some problems. How to how to get these things, what we should do with the mining stuff and 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 uh, yeah, good. That's all for today, people. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in the next one. See ya, guys.